Hey everybody, welcome to the Paw Pals Pet Channel. Today, we're going to go over the top 10 best dog breeds for first time owners. Thinking about getting your first dog? While it seems absurd to many of us, some people have never owned a dog before. And that's okay. We welcome you to the dark side. While there is a lot of research that goes into general dog ownership, there are some breeds of dogs that are better suited for a first timer than others. While all dogs are individuals within a breed and can vary greatly in personalities and needs, it's safe to say that your chances of finding a good novice dog are better within some breed limits than others. Remember that there is no bad dog breed. And if you're set on a breed that's not in this list, that's perfectly fine. Any first time owner can be successful with any dog, so long as they're committed. But for those looking for suggestions on breeds that might fit their newbie needs, you can use this list as a guideline. Number 10, Boston Terrier. Boston Terriers are very individualistic. Some are high spirited and clownish, while some are calm and dignified, even placid. Some are stubborn characters, while others are sweet and gentle. But in general, the Boston Terrier is an altogether dapper and charming little dog. Playing games and chasing balls are typically two of his passions. Seeking companionship is another, for the Boston always wants to be with his family. His large, expressive eyes, a tentatively cocked head, and snorting and snuffling sounds bring out parental feelings in many people. Extremely sensitive to his owner's moods, some Boston Terriers are one-person dogs with a special affinity for the elderly. But many are outgoing with everyone, and even the ones who are a bit standoffish are polite. Yet he is a dependable watchdog who will let you know when someone is at the door. Fine with other family pets, Boston Terriers may put on a blustery show upon spying larger dogs across the street, but they are seldom truly aggressive. This breed is often a good choice for first-time owners, as long as you can deal with the health issues resulting from their unnaturally short face. Number 9. Bull Terrier The Bull Terrier was originally developed in the 19th century as a fighting dog, and later a fashionable companion for gentlemen, but these days they're a family companion and show dog. They're a dog breed distinguished by their long, egg-shaped head. Even though these are purebred dogs, some may still end up in the care of shelters or rescues. Consider adoption if this is the breed for you. This dog is a lover, not a fighter. In fact, Bull Terriers are known for being affectionate to all the members of their household, especially children. Their friendliness and love of people also means they don't like to be left alone for long hours though. They want to be part of their humans daily activities because they have high energy and intensity these dogs need plenty of exercise and vigorous playtime if you can be firm and consistent with training stay active to keep up with your pup and provide plenty of love and attention then this dog may be your new best friend dog time recommends this dog bed to give you good night's sleep to your medium-sized bull terrier you should also pick up this dog brush and massager for your short-haired pup. Number 8. Golden Retriever The Golden Retriever is the quintessential family dog. This medium-large dog is happy, loyal, affectionate, and active. Goldens are smart and adaptable dogs that can thrive in most households. The breed does need regular brushing to keep its coat free of tangles and mats. Goldens also need a good amount of exercise to keep them in good physical condition and prevent boredom. Training is essential, but not difficult. They love to learn and can be trained to do a number of things. Golden Retrievers are eager to please and love spending time with their families. They're excellent with children of all ages. It's no wonder this is the world's most popular dogs. Number 7. Poodle Poodle is a well-known, popular, and versatile dog breed. This breed is available in three sizes, toy, miniature, or standard. All are very intelligent dogs that respond well to training. The Poodle needs to be groomed regularly to maintain the curly, continuously growing coat. Poodles are very energetic dogs, 
They need plenty of exercise and mental stimulation. With proper care, you are likely to find this breed to be a wonderful companion. The poodle is very adaptable to its environment and can do very well in a variety of households, including those with children. Number six, Greyhound. Greyhounds are the go-to dog for beginners looking for very low maintenance, large dogs as their first pets. This breed loves to sleep and is very docile and well-behaved while indoors. Because of this, you can expect your Greyhound to be a constant presence on your couch. That's if you allow dogs to lounge on your couch. You're probably wondering if this breed needs exercise at all with the way they love to sleep. The answer is yes. They need regular exercise just like all other dogs. They actually make great running speeds that makes them excellent sports companions. They also enjoy being part of the family during outdoor adventures, so be sure to carry yours along the next time you go out. Also, make sure you provide regular grooming to keep your Greyhound's coat looking great. Consider that this breed has a hunting instinct. You may want to keep him away from small pets in your home, like cats. Number five, Labrador Retriever. The Labrador Retriever is one of the most popular and recognizable medium-large dog breeds. Labs are deeply loyal and affectionate dogs that form close bonds with their families. This breed is active, playful, and smart. Labs thrive in active households that can provide plenty of exercise and training. Labs love to learn and can be trained to do almost anything. You can play fetch for hours or go for a run with your Lab then end the busy day snuggling on the couch. Without plenty of exercise and mental stimulation, labs may get bored and act out, especially during their younger years. Labs also tend to love all food and can easily become overweight if you are not careful. Fortunately, they only have minor grooming needs. Brush your lab regularly to minimize shedding. If you take good care of your lab, you will have a happy, lovable companion for life. Labs adapt well to most environments and are excellent with kids. Number four, Staffordshire Bull Terrier. Although they were created in 19th century Britain to be small, fast fighting dogs, these days are long past. Oh, those days are long past. The Staffordshire Bull Terrier dog breed of today is a fine companion known for their courage, intelligence, and love of children. Fans of the breed lovingly refer to them as Staffy for short. Even though these are purebred dogs, you may find them in the care of shelters and rescue groups. Remember to adopt. Don't shop if you want to bring one of these dogs home. Despite their affectionate and playful nature, Staffies do best with experienced pet parents who can socialize them early and keep up with consistent training. Meet the breed's needs and you'll have a faithful, adoring member of the family. Number three, Pug. These little, worried-looking doggos are always demanding cuddles and petting. Although their face has a flustered look, they are little clowns that are going to put a smile on your face. They love it when everyone's attention is on them, but they will turn sulky and heartsick if ignored. Pugs are loving and friendly to almost anyone they meet, even strangers and other pets. However, they can get jealous if you don't give them the same love as the other dog at the house. Pugs are great with kids since they are playful and have a low gait. Still, they can be stubborn at times. Number two. Cavalier King Charles Spaniel. The Cavalier King Charles Spaniel dogs are popular for being couch potatoes, but don't underestimate this breed. They have a sporty and playful personality, but with moderate exercise requirements. Cavalier King Charles Spaniel is a total sweetheart. They are friendly to anyone, kids, their owners, strangers, and even other canines. This makes them one of the best dog breeds for families and traveling owners. The Cavalier dogs are very intelligent and easy to train. 
They have low prey drive and wanderlust tendencies, which make living with them worthwhile. While I'll take bird and critter chasing as exceptions since these doggos love running after them, but most of the time they'll be cozying on the couch and demanding for a belly rub. Number one, French Bulldog. French Bulldogs are a good choice for first time owners. They require less exercise and grooming than large breeds and most of the time are simple to train. They are an adaptable dog breed that will fit in with most owners. The French Bulldog resembles a Bulldog in miniature, except for the large, erect, fat ears that are breed's trades, trademark feature. The head is large and square, with heavy wrinkles rolled above the extremely short nose. The body beneath the smooth, brilliant coat is compact and muscular. The bright, affectionate Frenchie is a charmer. Dog of Dogs of few words, Frenchies don't bark much, but their alertness makes them excellent watchdogs. They happily adapt to life with singles, couples, or families, and do not require a lot of outdoor ex exercise. They get on well with other animals and enjoy making new friends of the human variety. It is no wonder that city folk from Paris to Peora swear by this vastly amusing and companionable breed. Please subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss more videos of top 10 pet facts and much more. Check out this playlist of my top 10 videos of best pets and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.